Delhi Technological University DTU, formerly known as Delhi College of Engineering, is an engineering university located in New Delhi, India. It is one of the oldest engineering colleges in India and Delhi's first engineering college. It was established in 1941 as Delhi Polytechnic and was under the control of the Government of India. The college has been under the government of the National Capital Territory of Delhi since 1963 and was affiliated with the University of Delhi from 1952 to 2009. In 2009, the college was given state university status, thus changing its name to Delhi Technological University. Till the year 2009, DCE shared its admission procedure and syllabus for various BE courses with their other branch known as Nitaji Subhas Institute of Technology, formerly DIT, which were prescribed by Faculty of Technology, University of Delhi. It offers courses towards Bachelor of Technology B. Tech, Master of Technology M. Tech, Doctor of Philosophy PhD, and Master of Business Administration MBA, and contains 14 academic departments with a strong emphasis on scientific and technological education and research. From 2017, the university also offers courses like Bachelor of Business Administration and BA in Economics. History <inaudible> <inaudible> Delhi Polytechnic The seeds of Delhi Polytechnic were sowed by the Wood and Abbott Committee of 1938. It was established as Delhi Polytechnic in 1941. The technical school was created to cater to the demands of Indian industries. At that time, Delhi Polytechnic offered courses in arts, architecture, commerce, engineering, applied science and textiles. Walter William Wood, the father of technical education in India, became the founder principal of Delhi Polytechnic. The national diploma awarded by Delhi Polytechnic was considered an equivalent to the B.E. degree by the then UPSC. BE degrees in mechanical engineering, electrical engineering, chemical engineering and textile engineering were awarded to the students under Faculty of Technology, University of Delhi since 1952. A BE degree in civil engineering was introduced in 1955. In addition to merit of qualifying examination, test and or interview were held for the selection of candidates for admission. Up till 1962, the college was under the direct control of Ministry of Education, Government of India. Since 1963, Delhi Polytechnic was taken over by the then Delhi Administration and Chief Commissioner Delhi was the ex officio chairman of the college. It became a union territory college and 75% of seats were reserved for the candidates who passed their qualifying examination from a school situated in the union territory of Delhi. In 1963, Department of Arts became College of Arts and Department of Commerce and Business Administration was converted to several institutes of commerce and secretarial practices. Fragmentation of Delhi Polytechnic ultimately left behind an engineering institute alone. In 1962, the college was affiliated with University of Delhi. In 1965, the Delhi Polytechnic was renamed as Delhi College of Engineering and became the first engineering college of Delhi. BE degree course in production and industrial engineering was started in 1988 while BE degree course in computer engineering was started in 1989. BE degree level courses were started in polymer science and chemical technology and environment engineering in 1998. Information technology played a vital role during this era and the beginning of new millennium witnessed the introduction of BE in information technology in 2002. 
BE in Biotechnology was introduced from the academic session 2004-2005. The Department of Architecture of the Delhi College of Engineering became the School of Planning and Architecture, now a deemed university and institution of national importance. The Department of Arts and Sculpture became College of Arts and the Departments of Chemical Technology and Textile Technology were shifted out en bloc to mark beginning of the IIT Delhi at its new campus at Howes Kass. The Department of Commerce was later abolished and the Faculty of Management Studies of the University of Delhi was established by Prof. A. Das Gupta, of DCE. Delhi Administration established Delhi Institute of Technology presently Netaji Subas Institute of Technology in 1985 and the new college was established under the patronage of Delhi College of Engineering. DCE shared its campus with NSIT at Kashmiri Gate Campus, although later, NSIT was shifted to Dwarka as a follow-up of the Wood and Abbott Committee of 1938. Delhi College of Engineering is thus the mother institution of a number of national institutes including Indian Institute of Technology Delhi, Netaji Subhas Institute of Technology, School of Planning and Architecture, Delhi, College of Art, Delhi and Faculty of Management Studies, Delhi Assembly passed a bill on 1 July 2009 paving way for upgradation of Delhi College of Engineering to Delhi Technological University. New BE. Programs in Software Engineering, Automobile Engineering, Electrical and Electronics Engineering and Engineering Physics were introduced. Courses on Biotechnology, Nanotechnology, Bioinformatics, Computational Mathematics and MBA in Knowledge and Technology Management and Information Systems Management were also introduced. From 2018 they have started BDES course. Topic. Delhi Technological University In July 2009, Delhi College of Engineering was upgraded to a state university and renamed Delhi Technological University, through the Delhi Technological University Bill, 2009. P. B. Sharma was nominated as the university's first vice-chancellor. The move was met with student protests over the erosion of the DCE brand which culminated to a face-off in March 2010, with the students boycotting the mid-semester exams, and demanding reconsideration of the change and replacement of the VC. However, the Chief Minister of Delhi, Sheila Dixit informed the students that the change will not be reconsidered, and by the end of March the protest dwindled down, with the students taking their exams. In April 2010 Times City reported that the government will be willing to change the name to DCE Technological University. DCE2, however, as of June 2018 the university name remains unchanged till date. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Campuses. Delhi Technological University Delhi College of Engineering operated from the Kashmiri Gate campus in the heart of Old Delhi until 1989, when construction began at the new campus at Bawana Road in May. Moving of operations from Kashmiri Gate to the new 164 acres campus at Bawana Road began in 1995, and the new campus formally started classes for all four years of study starting 1999. The new lush green campus is well connected by road. Facilities include a library, a computer center, a sports complex, eight boys' hostels, six girls' hostels, and a married couple's hostel. The campus has residential facilities for faculty and staff. The campus has an auditorium and an open-air theater. DTU has opened up a campus in Vivek Vihar, East Delhi named University School of Management and Entrepreneurship USME. In 2017, the new campus offers management courses for graduation and post-graduation. 
Currently, the USME, East Campus of DTU offers courses in MBA, MBA Business Analytics, BBA, and BA in Economics. USME offers 60 seats for MBA students and 30 seats for MBA Business Analytics program. Admission to MBA is decided by CAT exam and further by rigorous group discussion and personal interview. Moreover, there are 120 seats for BBA and BA economics each. The admission to the courses is merit-based. Admissions The admission towards a full-time Bachelor of Engineering degree in DTU is through the Joint Admission Counseling Delhi, Jack Delhi process, together with Indira Gandhi Delhi Technological University for Women, Indraprastha Institute of Information Technology Delhi and Netaji Subhash University of Technology. For admission through Jack Delhi, 85% seats are reserved for students passing their class 12th from Delhi. Admission to foreign students is through the Direct Admission of Students Abroad (DASA) scheme. Admission to the BTEC Lateral Entry program is based on marks secured by the candidates in the state diploma examination. Admissions to the Evening Studies program is based on a common entrance examination. Admission towards a postgraduate degree is based on performance in the Graduate Aptitude Test in Engineering GATE qualifying exam. If two or more candidates have the same GATE score, then percentage in qualifying undergraduate course shall decide the merit. No separate test or interview is conducted by the university. However, for the NRIs, foreign nationals and persons of Indian origin PIOs, the admission is made on the basis of merit – score in Graduate Record Examination GRE. The medium of instruction for all the courses at the university is English. Candidates interested in taking admissions in M.Tech and Ph.D. courses can apply for the same online. Admissions in MBA program are based on Common Admission Test (CAT) exam, followed by a group discussion and an interview. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Academics. Courses are offered towards Bachelor of Technology B. Tech, Bachelor of Arts ONS Economics, Bachelor of Design B. Des, Master of Technology M. Tech, Master of Science M. Sc, Doctor of Philosophy PhD, Master of Business Administration MBA and Bachelor of Business Administration BBA. Topic research Students participate in projects such as design and development of a Formula SAE car, SAE Mini Baja, ASME HPV, hybrid car, solar car, unmanned aerial vehicles, innovative embedded devices appreciated worldwide and setting up a plant for manufacturing biodiesel, pioneered by the Defiance Racing Team participating in the Formula Student Competition, many student teams collaborate with universities universities from other countries and actively participate in international and national competitions. The college also came up with the development of a personalized mover, Mitra. Delhi College of Engineering is one of the TIFAC CORE's Technology Information, Forecasting and Assessment Council's Centers of Relevance and Excellence in Fiber Optics and Optical Communication. Also, students of Delhi College of Engineering have made it top 15 worldwide slots in the Microsoft Imagine Cup 2007 and 2008. The technical team UASDTU has been exceptionally successful, designing and building a prototype UAV, the Arush X1, with funding and mentorship from Lockheed Martin, USA. It also stood third in the AUVSI Student Unmanned Air System SUAS competition, 2012. The team has developed several prototype UAVs and expands its UAV count each year. 
The Solar Car Team, DTU Solaris was the first solar electric vehicle team in the country to have developed a two-seater passenger solar electric vehicle Arca in 2012. Its previous design, Avenir won the Most Economical Car Award in WSC 2011. The campus at DTU has been proposed as one of the sites for the Delhi government's plan of creating Delhi a research and IT hub. A knowledge park at DTU has been set up as part of better infrastructure for Delhi. DTU had been selected by Intel Technology Private Limited to join Planet Lab Consortium that has the world's top universities and industrial research labs like Princeton University, University of Washington and NEC Labs as its members, DTU organizes various events, conferences, seminars throughout the year so that students from other engineering institutes, organizations can also get benefited. Societies like ASME, SAE, IEEE, IET, MAX etc. frequently organize such events. <laughs> <laughs> Scholarships and awards Scholarships are available for students beginning their first year at the college, which are awarded on the basis of their performance in subjects. Another award is given to two final year students on the basis of merit, sponsoring their tuition for the purpose of pursuing MBA at the Raj Swan College of Business, Wright State University. Rankings <laughs> 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 Among engineering colleges, Delhi Technological University is ranked fifth by I3RC Times Engineering Survey in 2018, seventh by India Today in Government Engineering Colleges 2018, fourteenth by Outlook India in 2017 and tenth by The Week in 2017. The National Institutional Ranking Framework NIRF ranked at 41 in the Engineering Ranking of 2018, 70 among universities and 100 overall. Topic student life and culture The college organizes its own cultural and academic festivals. While the cultural festivals are a break from studies and comprise events such as music concerts and fashion shows, the academic festivals form a common platform for students and academicians across the country to meet and showcase research. The cultural festival Engifest is held every year in February. Engifest plays host to a variety of events like Star Night, rock shows, plays, dances, drag shows, and others. In the past Engifest has been celebrated by likes of Euphoria, Parikrama, Indian Ocean, and through performances by renowned artists like Manj Music, Raftar, Suraj Jagan, Hard Kaur, Shibani Kashyap, Mohit Chowan, Vishal, Shekhar etc. The fest season of the university begins in January and end in March. Yuvan, Literature and Film Festival is the first fest of the festive season in the third week of January. Followed by the Techfest Invictus and the Cultural Fest, Engifest follows suit in the second week of February. March experiences the Sports Fest, Arvan. The college also has a variety of technical festivals celebrated in the same month by various departments. The events see participation from all corners of the nation. ANOVA is the annual technical festival of DCE organized by the Civil and Mechanical Department in association with ASME, SEM and SAE. One of the most nationwide successful event of ANOVA Fest has been the Deltec MUN model United Nations. The event is an academic simulation of the United Nations, where delegates debate on world issues and international policies. Troika is the festival organized by the IEEE Students Branch. The IEEE Students Branch also established www.ie2.com, a student resource portal, for the benefit of the engineering student community. The Department of Computer Engineering and the Computers Society of India have their annual Technical Fest Cogenesis. 
Renaissance is a technical fest organized by the IET student chapter of DCE. Tattva is an annual technical symposium organized by the Department of Polymer Science and Chemical Technology in association with SPE. Karyon is the annual Tech Fest of DCE organized by Biotechnology Department. E-Summit is an event aimed to advocate entrepreneurship among students, with leadership lectures and panel discussions involving various stalwarts from the industry. It is conducted by the Entrepreneurship Development Cell of DTU, generally in February. Resonance is a collage of assorted literary and managerial events and serves as a stage for showcasing the talents of the students in fields other than science and engineering. Arena is the annual sports meet of the Delhi College of Engineering, and Virazar is the name for a host of cultural events organized by SPIC MACAY. Pratibim, the Dramatics Club of DTU, is a well known name in the collegiate level theatre circuit. Excelsior is a fest organized by Society of Robotics, DTU, Senior DTU. It's one of the biggest technical society of college and the fest is organized on a very large scale. It was founded in 2013, by some seniors of ECE, notably Varun Grover, 2016 pass out. DTU has a chapter of Stanford University's Asia-Pacific Student Entrepreneurship Society whose mission is to educate and network the future leaders in business, technology and the Asia-Pacific in order to foster a global entrepreneurship society. DTU was also host to the 2015 ASME's International Human Powered Vehicle Challenge India. Topic: Notable alumni. Vinod Dham, popularly known as the father of the Pentium chip, led the Pentium project at Intel. Arvind Saxena, chairman of UPSC. Vijay Shekhar Sharma, founder of Paytm. Ravi Grover, director, Homi Baba National Institute. Ex-Principal Advisor to Department of Atomic Energy, India. Responsible for the successful negotiations in the 2007 Indo-US nuclear deal Darendra Yogi Goswami, American inventor. Advisor to the US Congress and the Indian Government on Energy Policy and the Transition to Renewable Energy. Rabia Singh Bola, Arjuna Award winner, Olympian. Manish Kera, former CEO, Airtel Money, selected the Young Global Leader 2011, by the World Economic Forum Sushant Singh Rajput Sad Face, Dropout a Bollywood actor Rajinder Kumar, chemical engineer, Padma Bhushan recipient Surya Kant, president of Tata Consultancy Services in North America, United Kingdom and Europe Subhash Chandra Agrawal, social activist Mira Mukherjee, sculptor Sanjeev Ahuja, chairman and CEO of Tillman Global Holdings Durjoy Dutta, novelist, screenwriter and entrepreneur Sachin Garg, Indian best-selling novelist and entrepreneur Avinash Chandra, painter Manish Gulati, Executive Vice President, Strategic Initiatives, ATG Group